All right, welcome back and uh, hello again. I just wanted to talk about eyeglasses real quick and um, the experience that I had with my glasses just absolutely drove me crazy until I figured out what was going on. And um, I, I just got some new lenses ordered. The glasses I'm wearing now are about two and a half, three years old. These are the last pair of lenses that I had um, in the frames that uh, actually doesn't have this problem I'm going to talk about. And that is where you have a really strong purple or bright blue, or sometimes even a green reflection on the front of the lenses. I'm looking at my phone here to see, by the way, the SnapBridge app is really great uh, these days with the Nikon cameras. You get the Bluetooth connection to the phone. You don't have to turn on Wi-Fi. You just leave the Wi-Fi and the camera turned off all the time. Um, you turn on Bluetooth whenever you want to have it on. And then when the Bluetooth's on, you just open up your, your uh, once you got it paired, uh, open up your SnapBridge app. It'll connect to the camera and then you can just click the remote photography button and it'll start uh, activating the Wi-Fi link or the, uh, yeah, it'll turn on the Wi-Fi and the camera automatically. It'll ask you if you want to join that, um, you know, the Wi-Fi um, access to the camera. And, and anyway, so that works out great. Back to the glasses. So these glasses, I move my head around. You might see a little bit of a reflection and that's coming from the window behind me. Uh, actually, it's like a door with, you know, two doors with, with uh, windows pretty much top to bottom. So there's a little bit of reflection there. This, these glasses do have an anti-reflective coating, uh, but you notice if I move my head around or looking straight at the camera, I don't have a, any kind of a strange um, colored reflection. So if I put my new glasses on, or these are the pair I had from last year, instantly you see that, um, you see that purple reflection that's coming from the, the door, like you can see I'm trying to get this right here. That's the windows from the door. If I go right there, now see, look, you see there's one door and then there's the other one. And um, so as I get closer, you might be able to make that out a little bit better. So this is what the problem is. This coating, I think, is the six layer anti-reflective coating with something else related to blocking out certain types of lights for computer displays, because that's the other thing they'll start asking about. Well, how often do you use a computer? How long, how long do you stay do you use a computer? Oh, I use it eight hours a day because I'm well, eight, eight hours a day on a computer at work. And um, so they think they're doing you a favor, giving you this coating that blocks out certain types of light from the monitors and so on. And what ends up happening is you get this stupid reflection that's just absolutely infuriating. Because um, you know, <laughs> I was trying to get a picture of myself or a profile photo the other day. And no matter what I did, you know, using the window light, there was just no way I could get a picture where I have a normal position looking at the camera without that reflection in my glasses. So from what I heard that, you know, there's the six layer coating has, gives you that bluish purple look right now that you see. And then there's a nine layer coating that gives you like a greenish look. Um, but I, I think the key is that you don't want if you, if you don't want to have this reflection in your glasses, you just don't want to get whatever it is they're putting in there to block out this certain type of light coming from displays because they say that gives your eyes fatigue, blah, blah, blah. You know, like, well, you know what? I don't care about that. I just want to be able to see clearly, first of all, the colors. I want the colors to be accurate because the other thing is these glasses, when you, when you look through them, um, and you might want to do this yourself before you get new glasses, before you actually order them, uh, you know, don't wait until they arrive and then you don't know what your doctor is going to do and like, oh, well, if you want to get new glasses, we well, get to pay for it. Um, my doctors, you know, this is the second time around, they're actually going to give them for free, the lenses, because first of all, there was something not quite right with the prescription. And, uh, but secondly, I, after I discovered this problem and figured out what it was with the uh, purple-blue reflection, um, you know, I told them about that. And, you know, this really just unacceptable to me. I don't know why anybody would accept that. And then also, as you raise your glasses and look through, you know, to see what the color around you looks like, you realize, well, everything's got kind of a yellow cast to it because these lenses have sort of a yellowish tint. So that's the other thing. And I'm like, am I screwing up my pictures all this time for the last year or two because, of, you know, I got the white balance wrong because I'm looking through these lenses and, you know, everything has got a little bit of yellowish tint to it on my display because that's what the glasses are giving me. And maybe I'm cooling the uh, white balance down too much. It just was driving me nuts. So, yeah, as you can see moving around, look how, depending on the light source, if it's a bigger light source, 
like the entire lens would just have that really nasty purple reflection on it. And if I go back to my old glasses, you know, there you go. It's totally gone. And um, let's see, yeah, see there? As I move them around, um, it's just totally unbelievable. There you put them right on top of the other ones, <laughs> right above them. So, especially if you're a photographer um, or you do anything at all where you care about, first of all, how you look when you're looking you know, into a video camera, because I do a lot of video conferencing at work. Um, you know, that's kind of one of the things I do is involved in a lot of video conferencing. The cat's starting to get into a little tussle here. Um, I do a lot of video conferencing at work because that's part of my job is, you know, setting up the video conferencing equipment and testing it and making sure it works right. So I'm looking at myself in the video during the testing. I'm like, what the, you know, I see this bright purple reflection on my lens. I'm like, oh, no, I, I can't have that. Um, and we just look like a total idiot sitting there with this bright purple reflection on your lens and they can't even see your eyeballs. Um, so if it seems like I'm going off on a rant on this, I am because it, it really, when I figured out what was going on and, you know, kind of understood how that, that I could end up with lenses like that, probably based on all the questions they were asking me at the office, you know, about how often you use a computer display. Um, I think they end up pushing you into those filters and coatings that, that ends up creating that ridiculous purple reflection on your lenses. And I, you know, I don't fault the doctors for that really. Um, the people at the eye doctor, I think um, it was probably more, I'm just kind of keep an eye, I can't believe I'm already at 23 minutes on this. But um, you know, I, I, it's probably the manufacturers of these coatings pushing that to the doctors and you know, just like pharmaceutical companies or whatever, pushing them, telling them, oh, ask your patients this, ask your patients that, and this is what they really need. Yeah, that's what I need, a ridiculous purple reflection on my glasses. Need that like a, I need a hole in my head, you know, or screen door of a submarine. That's a totally useless. All right, so I'll shut up about that now. Uh, but if you ever need new glasses and they start asking about anti-reflective coatings and how often you use your computer each day, you better look really closely at what they're giving you and what they're suggesting. See if they have some samples. Look through it, you know, kind of look at the glasses, you know, position them with a light source coming from the other direction and look to see what that reflection looks like. If there is a reflection, um, you know, when that light hits it, because you don't want to have that really crappy uh, purple reflection, blue reflection, or bright green reflection. It just looks ridiculous. And it was just, to me, it just became infuriating, especially just trying to get a simple uh, profile photo of myself using a window light, just indirect window light like this, which is normally very flattering, good light. And uh, I just couldn't do it no matter how I positioned myself and it just drove me up the wall. It's like, I'm going to the doctor and you know, getting rid of these lenses. I don't care if I have to pay full price just for a new pair of lenses with no anti-reflective coating um, and just, just put some scratch resistant coating on the front of them. That's it. I, I do not want any kind of yellow tint when I'm looking through my lenses because it's going to screw up my white balance when I'm trying to edit. And um, the, the reflection is just unbelievable. So. That's what, that's it. Hopefully my frustration and my aggravation about this and my little experience would kind of help somebody that has this problem or might run into this problem, but just kind of keep that in mind. And, um, so looking around the little box bouncing around in my face, the, uh, I'm telling you the Z7, I love the Z7 and I'm waiting for that firmware update that, um, comes next month in May of 2019. I don't really need it for what I do, but you know, Hey, uh, if they're going to give it to me for free, I'll take it. All right. Thanks for watching. And I, I really hope that helped you because it, trust me, if I'd known this before I got the lenses, I could have saved myself a lot of aggravation. I've been dealing with this, this for probably a year and a half and I didn't really understand what was causing it. And then when I went to get my other glasses, the second pair, which is the pair that ends up having them now, that, that purple reflection, I told them, you know, like, look, these other glasses I just got last year had that reflection and I don't like that, that purple, whatever reflection. And lo and behold, here I come again with another set of lenses that's got that ridiculous reflection. And I'm just like, oh my God, that's, I can't take it. So I think finally we'll get it fixed. And uh, the doctor was really nice. Um, you know, they're giving me the second, second uh, go around on the lenses for free. I told them I'd pay for it, you know, no problem. But, all right, I got to stop. So thanks for watching.